Hello, you can see we're going to 18k here. Today, I'm going to talk about um, why people like the, the, the new pack. It's um, Order of Chaos. Um, people want this pack, you know. It's, it's, it's this pack. There are some brilliant cards in there. I'm looking at it right now. Um, people want this pack because you have Insectors, um, you have Ninjas. You have Evolsers, and there are some other staple cards that people will use. Um, let's start off with Dragon uh, with Insectors. Insectors are broken, and I will be doing a thing on them about cards from steroids because they are on steroids. I mean, you get Dragonfly, and I think you use Hornet if you ha if you have your hand a graveyard. Destroy a monster, switch someone in centipede, get the effect to equip Hornet, Hornet's effect, destroy it, or something, you know, it's a bit of a loop a loop. And also, it's a level 3 monster, so you'll be able to exceed for the Dyson Dragon and Zen Means. So, it is a uh, nice deck, it is a nice format, meta, blah, 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 blah. It's a nice deck. Um, Ninjas, they do have potential with exceeding, summoning. I mean, you. I, I, I no one's made a perfect, perfect deck yet, but you do use the Ninjitsu art um, transformation in you, where you tribute one, monster, one ninja monster on your side of the field and one monster on your opponent's side of the field, which is some one dragon, sea serpent thingy from your, you know, from your deck or hand, I believe, and get out white dragon ninja. Which stops your spells and trap cards from being destroyed. So, equip safe zone to White Arm Dragon Ninja. I think that's what it's called. Let me have a look. I have it right here. That's it. Yeah, White Dragon Ninja. This card cannot be special summoned except by the effect of the Ninjutsu art card. So, on trap cards you, can't, you can control cannot be destroyed by card effect. So, safe zone will make this card unstoppable. Uh, I've seen one of my mates use Shard of Greed because, you know, your opponent can't destroy anything. You have no risk. And I believe that if you have three Shard of Greed, you draw nine cards. No, sorry. One draw. Three, three, three. You draw ten cards from one turn. Actually, wait. I think it's two. Two, two, two. Yeah, sorry. Seven cards. Probably. But you might want to save those draws. But, you know, it's... The only way to get rid of it is removal... Or put it back to your hand. So, Brionac, um, Trishula, Mistworm, all them cards. So, it'd be quite, you know, if your opponent hasn't got anything to do, like, you know, use this Trishula, use this Mistworm, use this Chaos Orcs, or even use this VLX, that'd be the time to summon White Dragon Ninja. Um, another card, you know, some of these cards haven't come out yet, like the rarities, but I believe that White Dragon Ninja would be a secret rare. And it's a TCG exclusive. The other TCG exclusive TCG exclusive that everyone wants is Tour Boss of the Underworld. And it's the fact is, is that when this card is sent to the graveyard, target one monster in in either player's graveyard except Tour Boss and put it back to the deck or something, you know, put that card back to the deck. Now, in my opinion, it's not that good. The reason I say it's not that good is because I can't afford Tour Guide. Um, and I believe that, you know, Tour Guide, Tour Guide is a nice card, but, you know, I've just put my hand away from it, you know, just slap that bitch. But when I look at Tour Bus and talk to my mates about it, we had a nice conversation about it. Would you run three Tour Buses? Two Tour Buses? But the only problem is, is that how many tour buses, how many tour guides do you run? People either run three or two. If you run three tour buses, you won't be able. You don't know if you're going to get those in your hand. So, in my opinion, I said to my mate, if you have one, run one, because that means you don't have to waste the sand gown. If you run three tour guides, run one bus, because that means you have sand gown, and then you have another tour bus. You have tour bus. If you want, you can have another tour bus. And then you can, you know, add one card from your graveyard back to the deck. Now, if it was draw one card, then yes, it would be even better. But in my opinion, it's so, you know, it's okay. It's just another 
useless cards that people would want. And it's a dark, so you know, you can remove it away from BLS. Because you can't put tall back to the deck. So it's a useless card in the green. Um I believe that's it really. I mean I don't think I have anything else to say about you know, in that there are some nice succeed monsters. Um with Chaos Number, Thirty Nine, Utopia Array, um it, it, it has potential. I don't think anyone would use it, but it has potential. I think there's number ninety six and that's a nice card. That's plasma on crack. Um the insect one's okay. Uh I don't uh, oh yeah. Run this out. The other card that everyone wants or people that you know are looking for wind ups. How can I forget wind ups? I'm making them in the future and I forgot it. See slap that face. So yeah, wind ups. You know, you've got wind up rat, and you've got wind up zen mighty, and wind up honeybee, and people will be after those cards definitely. Now, in my opinion, honeybee will be a common, rat will be an ultra, and zen mighty will be either a secret rare or probably an ultra, and then uh, wind up rat will be a super. So there are kind of random things. There's not even the rarities come out yet, but when zen mighty goes out, you know that is the main card that probably some people would want because you do the loop. I don't. I don't technically think it's a loop yet, but you know, you get out. You. I think the combo is you foolish burial, wind up hunter, and then you summon tour guide, get out tour bus because I'm talking about order of chaos. Exceed is in mighty. Use the effect to get giant uh, wind up rat, and then use the effect to push someone wind up hunter, and then. You see hundreds effect to get rid of Zen Mighty, one card from your opponent's hand, exceed, another card from your opponent's hand. But I believe you'd be able to get rid of four cards from your opponent's hand. If you have Monster Reborn, then you are lucky. If it's your first turn, your opponent can't do shit. But that's what my opinion is. I might be able to get a box of Order of Chaos. Um I believe my photo on Shockwave is coming pretty soon. The fingers cross of that, and I will open it when I do get it, because I owe my father uh, some money for that. Um, yeah, so what do you think about Order of Chaos? Comment on this video and subscribe to my channel because you guys love me.